I, I think people need to, people need to know. People need to know what's going on. People just don't have enough information. And I want to see it. I want to see it firsthand myself. I think that could really help the situation in, in terms of creating a deeper understanding of what we're up against here and what, what we need to do. Most of the destruction to the environment is under the water. I think anything, you can't see them and you don't know they're there, then you don't really care about them. The fish is the silent majority, it doesn't, it doesn't say a word, it never makes, never complains. And I believe strongly in local, local knowledge. We grew up fishing for three days a week. We haven't done that for 40 years. And those are the people I want to talk to, and I want to be a voice for them. There's a lot of young people now that's had to move away because there's no work here. And years ago, when we had our ground fishery, our lobster fishery, and everything that was strong. I don't want to be a lone voice. I want to speak on behalf of the people who are being affected directly. The people who make a living from the water, who depend on the water for their food, for their livelihood. I want to help get their voice out to whoever, to the public. And the public and then in turn will put pressure on the politicians to, to put pressure on the industry to do it differently, to do it better.